Right now, at five investigators say a woman from Peru is safe after being kidnapped for more than 24 hours, and the suspect is now on the run. The search quickly spreading statewide. Thanks for watching. I'm Rebecca Brumfield. Shelby has the night off. Durante Matthews is live in Peru, where a press conference wrapped up minutes ago. Durante, what do investigators say they know so far? Well, Rebecca, police say, first of all, Peru police say that woman originally believed to be a teenager between the ages of 14 to 16 is actually a woman in her 20s, a Peoria resident, and they say they found her this morning in her Peoria address, but now she's in a safe and secure location. They also say the man who kidnapped her is someone who she was actually in a relationship with, and they're now investigating this as an as a, um, give me one second, I'm sorry. They're investigating this as a domestic abduction, I'm sorry. So for a brief background, they say she was in a relationship with a 27-year-old man. His name is Bobby Cross. And they say Cross drove to Peru yesterday where he picked up the young woman. She got in the car with him, got out, and then he ended up forcing her back in the car. And they say community members then reported a crime of a woman screaming for help. They say this happened on the corner of 7th and Plum Street. So police, again, say they found her this morning in her Peoria address, and she's safe, and now Cross is on the run. We have a lot of physical evidence that has to be analyzed at labs, that sort of thing. A lot more statements to obtain, a lot more uh, video evidence we're going to continue to receive. But in the meantime, the community's safe. There's no threat to the public or any children or any adults. Now, Peru, uh, Peru police is once again thanking the community for their for their cooperation and helping to report the crime that eventually led to them creating a task force that helped them find the woman in the first place. They say once again that Cross is still on the run, and once they locate him, they'll try to add on additional charges from the abduction yesterday. For now, live in Peru, Durante Matthews, WMBD News.